This presentation will provide an overview of the CYP3A4 and quetiapine gene drug pair. I'll start off by providing an introduction to quetiapine. It is a prescription-only oral medication developed by AstraZeneca and was FDA approved in 1997. It is branded in addition as Seroquel, Viroquel, and three generic names, Quetiapine, Cyquel, and Quetiapine. It is a short-acting, atypical antipsychotic and antidepressant which provides improvements from first-generation antipsychotic medications. Its indications include schizophrenia, bipolar disorder, major depressive disorder, or unipolar and bipolar depression. Some of its side effects include sedation, such as when treating MDD, and as a note, it is marketed as one of the most sedating of all antipsychotics. Some of the common adverse effects include dry mouth, dizziness, headache, and And now we'll walk through the mechanism of action of quetiapine. Quetiapine is a dopamine, serotonin, and adrenic antagonist, as well as a potent antihistamine with clinically negligible um, anticholinergetic properties. It binds strongly to serotonin receptors, some of which are actually autoreceptors whose blockade tends to increase the release of neurotransmitters. It is also a partial antagonist of at 5 HT1A receptors and it was known to rapidly dissociate from the D2 receptor. In addition, its documents have 100% bioavailability and 83% protein binding. It is metabolized by the gene CYP3A4, um, and this is through um, hepatic metabolization via the CYP3A4 catalyzed sulfoxidation to its active metabolite, um, norquetiapine, or n quetiapine. This active metabolite mediates antidepressant activity and is mainly formed by the gene CYP3A4. The CYP3A4 inhibitors increase quetiapine plasma concentrations, and it's found that the magnitude of interaction with this drug really varies depending on the potency and dose of the gene inhibitor, as well as the susceptibility of the patient. Quetiapine is metabolized by the cytochrome P450, or CYP3A4, to inactive metabolites, and drug interactions with inhibitors and inducers are likely to be significant. This diagram here shows an example of the inhibitors and inducers of CYP3A4 and its effects with quetiapine. CYP3A4 is a part of the cytochrome 450 family and is encoded by the gene located on the chromosome 7Q21.1, as shown in this image here. An important paralog is CYP4F22. The gene CYP3A4 was found to have 28 single nucleotide polymorphisms, or SNPs, that were identified in the gene. Um, but this does not necessarily translate into significant individual variability in vivo. There have been over 20 variants found in the gene, uh, and it has found to be um, have significant divergence in the gene for specifically the CYP3A4 1G allele. In terms of variation across different populations, um, there was a large difference across ethnic groups in frequency of the CYP3A4 variants. In white populations, high frequencies of this gene in the 2 and 7 uh, configurations were found, and for Asian populations, high frequencies of the 16 and 18 allele configurations were found. In terms of the functional impact, um, the clinical significance of CYP3A4 variant alleles for many drugs are metabolized by the gene is minimal, and the common polymorphisms in the gene don't really appear to have important functional significance. There have not been extensive studies done on the gene drug pair quetiapine and CYP3A4, so there's a relatively low level of evidence available. However, there is potential clinical utility of pharmacogenomics for this drug. CYP3A4 may obscure the clinical effect, which is a substrate of CYP3A4. Therefore, this may affect the shown efficacy of drugs metabolized by CYP3A5. Some key questions that we have investigated with gene drug pair include the clinical significance of the CYP3A4 variant alleles for drugs metabolized, as well as clinical meaning, clinically meaningful phenotyping of CYP3A4, as well as dual pathway potential of the CYP3A4 with CYP3A5 and similar interactions with quetiapine. 